Hello and welcome to Chocolate Geology. Millions of years of geology crammed into a few minutes with the help of some chocolate. So what's a Mars bar got to do with this beautiful landscape you can see in the distance behind me? Well, if you'd been here about 400 plus million years ago, that's right, 400 plus million years ago, we'd have been slap bang in the middle of the Caledonian mountain building phase. That's when lowland Scotland here is crashing into northern Scotland there. Now these bits of Scotland were in two totally different continental plates. As the continental plates came together, they threw up these massive mountains, apparently the height of the Himalayas are today. Still don't know what that's got to do with Mars bar. Well, we're going to use that, the Mars bar, to represent our continental plates. The hard chocolate on the top is the cr Earth's crust, the ground we're standing on, and the soft squidgy bit, technical term, is, represents the Earth mantle. What we need to try and do is break it gently across the top to get a wee like that, you can see there's a line across there. So we've got the lowlands on one side and the highlands on the other. Ease it apart slightly and then push together. Now, if it all worked properly, you will push up some mountains, giving a perfect representation of what the, uh, the, this landscape 400 million years ago. And to be honest, if it doesn't work, just eat that one and have another go, but shh, I didn't say that. Okay, so why is that important? Well, all you can, all that's really left to see of that is the Highland Boundary Fault Zone that passes through the southern end of the National Park. Uh, places you can look at that are Calendar at the crags above the, above Calendar, or if you go to Brackland Falls, the Celtic water pours down through the falls from the highlands and into the lowlands. If you're up at Aberfoyle, up at the lodge, you can look out over the lowlands from the highlands, and if Conic Hill behind me, you're right in the Highland Boundary Fault Zone, gives you a panoramic view of the whole thing. So there you go. If you want to find out more about how you can relate chocolate to geology, nip over to the Loch Down Learning Hub for more information. Thanks very much. Bye.